Welcome back to TW 2016. I'm here once again with my new Japan save. We are going into night six of the G1. Here are the standings as they stand in A block. Sonata leads with 10. Cody has 8. Okada has 8. Shibata has 6. And then Castagnoli, Elgin, and Tanahashi all have 4, as, long as, as well as Paige also has 4. Evil has 2, and Tomatonga is still at 0. Over in B block, Saber, Zack Sabre Jr. is with has 8. Murafuji is tied with him at 8, and so is Naito at 8. Omega is at 6. Styles, who is injured and out of the tournament and is forfeiting the rest of his matches, still at 6. He'll end up at 8, and so will Juice, and Juice Robinson will end up with 6, despite him um, being out of the tournament as well, because they still have yet to face each other. So I get, guess it'll count as a win for both. I, I guess it's a draw, so they'll each get up 1 point. And then Ishii is at 4. Daichi, Kitamura, and Anderson are all at two. So let's get started. We kick off the night with the hype promo for the main event. Okada and Castagnoli. That should be a really good match. And then a 77 hype to promote that Kenny Omega's match tonight was supposed to be against AJ Styles. AJ Styles has to forfeit that match. So Kenny Omega goes on to eight points. Yep, eight points. Carl Anderson is at a is also announced he was supposed to face Juice Robinson. Well, guess what? Juice Robinson's hurt too. So, Carl gets two points. And then here we go, 69C+, plus as Daichi Hashimoto defeats Tomohiro Ishii. Good match. Uh, not a good match. Not a bad match. Not a good one either. I expect better from Hashimoto. I expect better from Shibata, although I imagine that's probably the booking decisions, right? <laughs> yeah, Tomatonga gets a surprise win over Katsuyori Shibata. Kind of shock out of nowhere to get his first two points. Here we go, 81B as Tetsuya Naito defeats Katsuya Kitamura in 13.02 by pinfall with the flying splash. Very good match. Eh. I imagine this is because of the fatigue and everything. Sonata is fatigued. Everyone's fatigued. It's the G1. Anyways, Sonata defeats Michael Elgin. He goes up to 12 points. Still undefeated in the G1 this year. Man, he's doing great. 70 C plus here for Hangman Page and Hiroshi Tanahashi. I feel like a day's rest, a couple days rest is needed after this night. Anyway, Tanahashi... Lo beat, loses to Hangman Page. Hangman Page wins. ADB, here we go. This was originally supposed to be my main event until I realized, hold on, Okada and Cl Claudio haven't fought yet. That's that's the main event. Anyway, Zack Sabre Jr. defeats Naomichi Marafuji by pinfall with the Roaring Elbow. So Sabre Jr. moves on with another two points. Here we go, 77B. Cody's getting consistently B matches. It's all right from the IWGP champion for right now. Cody defeats Evil. Um, not much other to say other than, you know, he wins. 66C plus here for a um, cool down match as Tongaloa and Dave Mastiff beat Doug Williams and Rampage Brown. And Doug Williams and Rampage Brown apparently have excellent chemistry together. Oh, uh, well, okay. C plus entrance from Castagnoli. 85 B plus entrance from Okada. Come on, good match, good match, good match. 88 B plus. There we go. Superb wrestling, great heat. Kazuchika Okada defeats Claudio Castagnoli, and afterwards he cuts a promo saying the Rainmaker is coming back for the G1 for his second straight year in a row. And the show got an 85 B plus thanks to that main event. Okada and Castagnoli saved that one from being a really disappointing show. Um, second best match of the night was Sabre Jr. and Murafuji. So good job, great job, got you two. Happy, pleased, pleased. All right, guys, we got through a night of the G1 without an injury. Woo, we got through a night of G1 without an injury. That. That is pretty surprising to me right now, considering the last two have had injuries. 
Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. If you have a prediction, who's going to win the G1? Leave in the comments. Thanks so much again, guys. I will see you guys next time.